Hey Bookmatic Lifelong Learners, as you can see in the intro to this video, I'm in Portland, Oregon, a traveling to my hometown on my holiday, my long summer break, and I, t I paid a little visit to Powell's Books, and I picked up a few books, and I just wanted to show you a quick tour of the uh, bookstore. Not really a tour, but show you the books that I got and uh, kind of explain the reason why I got those books. So let's get into the video and uh, I'll show you what I got. Hey, hey, what are you going to get? Uh, I'm going to get these books. Oh, that's Daddy's books too. Yeah, and yeah. I'm going to get these books. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Show the camera. Oh, yeah. Turning red. And what's the other one? What's the other one? Mm -hmm. And then what are the books that Daddy getting? Can you show those real quick? Mm -hmm. The first book is? Uh, show it. It's called The Adult Learner. And the second book is? Turn it around. Building a Second Brain by Tiago Forte. Thank you very much for showing. All right, so I hope you like that little tour. I mean, I didn't show you too much of the bookstore, but there's plenty of floors. There's a lot of floors there, a lot of books, uh, a lot of great choices. And uh, the books that I picked up, one that my daughter showed you was uh, Building a Second Brain by Tiago Forte. And I picked up this book because I'm very interested in uh, digital note taking, uh, basically building a second brain, which is an extremely interesting topic, very useful topic. And the uh, second book that I got here was um, uh, The Adult Learner by Malcolm Knowles, Elwood F. Holton the third Richard A. Swanson. So uh, yeah, those are the books that I picked up. Uh, this one's gonna be very useful for uh, instructional designing. Um, and yeah, so this, uh, a couple of the things that I wanted to mention about Powell's books. So as I'm living over in Indonesia, I don't have that huge of a selection of books that actually will very much benefit uh, what I do. Uh, with teaching and learning and uh, instructing and designing uh, curriculum and stuff like that. Um, so I cannot really get a hold of many books unless I read them on Kindle or if I order through Amazon and get it shipped over to Indonesia. And uh, that costs quite a lot. So when I was searching at Powell's books, I found a, a whole section on uh, some of the books that I was very much interested in. And I also browsed through like the psychology section and, uh, and philosophy. And I found so many books that I wanted to get, but because I'm traveling, I can't really take those books back with me. Uh, so that's why I only got two at this huge bookstore with millions of books. Um, I'm actually really planning on moving back to the U.S. just so that I can, uh, well, one of the reasons, not the main reason, but just so that I can access books, like, because those are going to help me out so much in, uh, in my career and stuff like that, and uh, you probably know, as you, all of you watching are probably avid readers as well, so, uh, yeah, that's my plan in the next year is to look for instructional designer jobs 
and move back to the US and then I'll be able to access these books. One of the negative aspects that I found at uh, Powell's Books, of course, they do not have everything. And uh, it's, it is nice to walk into a bookstore, smell the smell of books, and to actually hold them in your hand uh, compared to shopping online uh, on Amazon. I actually bought a few books on Amazon as well. So these two books are not the only two books that I'm bringing back with me. Um, I also got a book called Map It, which is all about like instructional designing uh, for corporate um entities or organizations or businesses so anyway uh i hope you enjoyed the video definitely uh if you're in portland check out that bookstore you'll love it um since it's big and got lots of different choices uh, and you can you know buy a book grab a coffee sit down and read it it's a pretty comfortable uh, environment so enjoy and uh check out the previous video that i filmed at pals books and like I said earlier, I link it to the top or you can uh, go into the description. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for watching everyone. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe for more videos like these. Also follow my other social media accounts such as Instagram, Facebook and Twitter for more valuable content. Thank you for watching again and I will see you guys next time.